Hey guys, so uh, this is not a Shelby video, but it is going to be a how-to video. Um, you know, a, a lot of you guys might have, you know, your little dailies. This is my 2013 or 14, I can't remember, uh, 2013 or 14 Hyundai Elantra. And the AC is not working and down here in Texas it's starting to get pretty hot. I mean, we, yesterday I think we reached about 85 and obviously it gets around um 105 sometimes in the summertime even more sometimes so i do know that i have a leak somewhere because i uh, i did this last year before summer started i went ahead and recharged it and uh, i'm sure i can go ahead and spend the money right now uh, and uh, you know replace whatever line is leaking or whatever is leaking it could be condenser it could be a line it could be anything and i i really don't know and i you know it's just my daily and it's for i'm going to show you for 30 dollars this is not going to apply to every car that needs ac sometimes you need more sometimes you need less but i'm going to go ahead and show you how to recharge your ac system for 30 dollars buying something from the local auto parts store so let's go ahead and get into it Alrighty. so i went in there and i got myself this can which the brand is avalanche premium 134a that's what my car takes so um, obviously they're gonna have a whole bunch of different ones different brands uh, some cans are gonna be bigger some are smaller some have a little gauge that tells you how how much freon you put in the system and the right amount of freon this brand right here or this newer style comes with these smart clips that you take off the clips you put them in the vents and then you just uh, refill it um, which I'm gonna show you guys how to do it and these clips are supposed to change color once the right amount of freon uh, and the temperature in the AC has reached the temperature that it's supposed to be at so step number one is gonna have the car running step two you're gonna go ahead and turn it all the way uh, to full-on blast a AC make sure your AC is on and we're gonna go ahead and take these clips off both of them Okay, so we're gonna put them in here. So there's one. We're gonna put the other one right next to it. If I can, it's kind of hard to do with one hand. One second. Alrighty, so I got both of them on. Step three, go ahead and pop your hood. Make sure I don't lock myself out of here. Yeah, don't judge. <laughs> this is the daily, so obviously all my money goes to the Shelby most of the time. But it does need some work. Uh, but it's, you know, it's just the daily. So on every car, you're going to have a high side AC. Uh, and then you're going to have a low side. On my car, the low side is sitting behind this plastic. which is going to be right there. So very carefully, you're going to reach up in there take the cap off right you're gonna take the cap off and with this unit uh, you're gonna pull up like this it's gonna allow those little teeth to contract and put it on there and then we're gonna go ahead and start uh, with releasing the free on righty guys so I got it connected on the low side oh, I got it connected on the low side now what we're gonna do is just press the button you're gonna hear it start to uh, go in there you hold it for a little while make sure that it's it's under and it's engaging I actually feel it and they'll actually tell you on some of their products I don't know if this can will do it but I know the bigger can where it says avalanche is gonna turn blue I don't know if the small can will do it but for sure their bigger can does that and to let you know hey you do have flow and the, the system is being recharged. So I've held it for about, they tell you to move it around. Just to make sure that the airflow is, is happening. The can feels a lot cooler. So let's go check. Uh, it's starting to change just a little bit of color so let's keep going alrighty so after holding it for about 10 15 more seconds 
uh, I can actually feel it is starting to you know blow a little cold it might need a few few minutes for the entire system to start blowing but yeah just pretty much hold the can until until you don't hear anything else coming out of it and I think you're pretty much good Alrighty, guys so to finish the video obviously after you're done and you don't hear you know any more freon inside the bottle you're pretty much done um this one says that it's supposed to stop leaks i don't really believe that but uh i went ahead and put the entire bottle in it there's nothing else in it uh once you guys hear that everything is uh that it stopped pumping because these are pressurized just like a regular can that you go and paint stuff with these are pressurized like that so once it's uh it stopped then you know you're good to go as far as the clips themselves they didn't really change color too drastically but you know maybe because these are old or whatever they can might be old but you know it's uh they did change a little bit of color nothing crazy um so yeah if you um you know if you feel like you have a slow leak and it's summertime again and you know you find out like after so many months of not needing the ac you turn it on you're like crap i need i need an ac job save yourself the money uh, just go to a regular auto zone and uh, start with this because this might actually get you shoot another another year until you're able to get whatever repairs done that you need um obviously this is my daily you know I, if it was the shelby i would have been messing around but this is just the daily and uh you know i i don't really care so much about it but i hope this video is helpful to somebody out there and uh yeah uh, it'll save you guys some money this is really easy to use i just showed you exactly how to use it for 30 bucks and uh Oh, another thing, uh, up, quick update on the Shelby. I'm doing some work on it. Um, I should be finishing the car either by later on today or tomorrow. I'm changing the entire look of it drastically. Um, so it will be a different, uh, a different color, basically. I'm changing the color on the, on the Shelby and, uh, I'm really excited about that. I hope you, I, I know you guys are going to like the color combination I'm going with. Um, and it's just something that every time I see these, these cars this color scheme i'm like man that's the color to have but anyways uh i'm gonna be showing you guys that in the next video this sunday we got another track or not a track event an autocross event and i'm gonna be going more in depth on um you know driving um tutorials and um little little tips and tricks to be able to go around the corners faster and uh yeah you guys stay tuned for that one thank you so much for the support i just reached 300 subscribers overnight so i'm very very happy about that thank you guys for the support and uh keep uh keep you know following the channel it's it's growing and i really really appreciate everybody who uh you know it's supporting and commenting so i'll catch you guys on the next one thank you